how powerful will AI be? Of course, with this incredible future power of AI, which I think will be difficult to imagine, frankly. This question, the super intelligent AI that's out of control, it would be a big mistake to build a super intelligence AI that we don't know how to control. Ilya Sutskever, co-founder of OpenAI, has launched a new venture called Safe Super Intelligence. This company breaks away from the pack with a singular focus, developing artificial intelligence that surpasses human intelligence in a safe and controlled manner. While the idea of superintelligence is exciting, questions remain. Can safe superintelligence achieve its ambitious goal? And how will safe superintelligence impact our world? Let's find out. Safe Superintelligence Company. After spending nearly 10 years overseeing superintelligence at the artificial intelligence startup OpenAI, Ilya Sutskever decided to leave in May. During his time there, Sutskever led the super alignment team which had a crucial role in managing AI systems and making sure that highly advanced AI wouldn't become a threat to people. However, shortly after Sutskever left, the team was disbanded. Shortly after Sutskever left OpenAI, another AI researcher, Jan Like, also decided to leave the organization. He pointed out that safety procedures, which are crucial for making sure AI is used safely and responsibly, were not getting enough attention. Instead, he felt that there was more focus on developing impressive new products that do not have enough safeguards in place. Gretchen Kruger, who worked on policies at OpenAI, also expressed similar concerns when she announced she was leaving. Safety is a big issue in AI because we need to make sure that as these technologies advance, they do so in a way that doesn't put people at risk or cause harm. Their departures highlight an ongoing debate in the AI community about how to balance innovation with safety. While it's important to push the boundaries of what AI can do, it's equally important to ensure that these advancements are made responsibly and with proper consideration for potential risks. When Ilya Sutskever left OpenAI, he hinted at starting a new project. Now he has officially launched a new company. On Wednesday, Sutskever announced on Twitter that he is starting a company called Safe Super Intelligence. The term superintelligence was coined by Oxford philosopher Nick Bostrom in his 2014 book titled Superintelligence. This term describes a hypothetical future AI that is much smarter than any human and can operate independently. It's an idea that fascinates and worries many people because such an AI could potentially outperform humans in every task and make decisions on its own. Sutskever's new company model Sutskever's new company, Safe Superintelligence, aims to address these concerns. The goal is to ensure that as AI technology advances and we move closer to creating superintelligent AI, we do so safely and responsibly. This means developing AI systems that are not only powerful, but also aligned with human values and goals. The company will focus on researching ways to control and guide superintelligent AI, making sure it benefits humanity rather than posing risks. Artificial intelligence experts often emphasize two main points when speaking publicly. First, they talk about how advanced and capable AI has become. AI can now perform many complex tasks that were once thought to be the exclusive domain of humans. These include recognizing speech, diagnosing diseases, driving cars, and even creating art and music. This rapid advancement is transforming various industries and making our lives easier in many ways. However, experts also make it clear that AI won't turn into something like Skynet from the movie, The Terminator. Skynet is a fictional AI that becomes self-aware and decides to wipe out humanity. Experts assure us that while AI is powerful, it doesn't have the desire or intent to harm us. AI systems do what they're programmed to do, and they don't have feelings or motivations like humans do. Despite these assurances, governments around the world are taking precautions to ensure that AI remains safe and under control. They are asking companies that develop AI technologies to commit to certain principles. These include ensuring safety and transparency in how AI systems operate and incorporating a kill switch that can shut down an AI system if it starts behaving in unexpected or dangerous ways. This is a safeguard to prevent any potential harm if an AI system were to go rogue. Ilya's company is a notable example of this concept. 
His company is built on the principle of prioritizing safety and transparency in AI development. Ilya has pledged that his team, investors, and business model are all working towards the same goal, creating safe superintelligence. He emphasizes that their efforts will be focused and unified with one primary objective and one main product. The company's website is currently simple, featuring just a text message signed by Ilya Sutskever and co-founders Daniel Gross and Daniel Levy. Daniel Gross is known for co-founding the search engine Q, which Apple acquired in 2013. Daniel Levy previously led the optimization team at OpenAI. Their message on the website highlights that safety is the most important factor in their mission to build an artificial superintelligence. They approached safety and capabilities in a way that combines both as technical challenges to be solved through groundbreaking engineering and scientific discoveries. One of the reasons they can focus so intensely on safety and innovation is that they don't get sidetracked by unnecessary management layers or constant product cycles. Instead of being bogged down by the typical business distractions, safe superintelligence keeps its attention on developing and refining its technology. Their business model also helps. Unlike many companies that might rush things to meet short-term commercial goals, safe superintelligence ensures that safety, security, and progress are protected from such pressures. This means they don't have to compromise on safety just to make a quick profit. Instead, they can take the time needed to do things right, prioritizing long-term success and reliability over immediate gains. This approach allows safe superintelligence to create advanced technologies that are both powerful and safe, ensuring that their innovations can be trusted and relied upon by users across various industries. The new SSI lab is being called the world's first straight-shot superintelligence lab, according to the announcement. The company aims to hire the best technical experts to solve what Sutskever calls the most important technical problem of our time. Right now, the company has two offices, one in Palo Alto and one in Tel Aviv. They chose these locations because they have strong connections there and can easily find top technical talent. People have been waiting for Sutskever's company announcement ever since he left OpenAI in May. Sutskever had played a pivotal role at OpenAI, having been not only a co-founder, but also a board member who had been involved in internal leadership dynamics. His departure came amidst internal strife at OpenAI, including a high-profile attempt to remove CEO Sam Altman, which had caused a stir within the company and among its stakeholders. Sutskever's departure raised questions about the future direction of OpenAI and its internal stability. The company's future direction. The rise of advanced AI technologies is sparking a big question. Who will ultimately control one of the most significant technological advancements in recent decades? Various tech giants and startups are vying for a leading position, each bringing their unique strengths and innovations to the table. OpenAI, for instance, has been making significant strides even without one of its key figures, Ilya Sutskever. They recently launched GPT-40, a new feature that enhances the capabilities of their AI. This updated version can respond to requests faster, reason more effectively, and even hold conversations using both voice and a smartphone camera. These improvements make interacting with AI more seamless and intuitive, pushing the boundaries of what AI can do. At the same time, major companies like Google, Apple, Facebook, and Microsoft are also ramping up their AI efforts. Each of these tech giants has announced new AI features and initiatives, aiming to outdo each other and stay ahead of a rapidly growing number of startups entering the AI space. This competition is driving rapid advancements in AI technology, benefiting consumers with more powerful and versatile AI tools. Interestingly, Ilya Sutskever has indicated a different approach for his own company. In an interview with Bloomberg, he mentioned that his company does not have any near-term intention of selling AI products or services. This suggests that Sutskever might be focusing on longer-term goals, possibly aiming to refine the technology further before commercializing it. His strategy contrasts with the immediate market competition seen among other tech giants, highlighting diverse approaches within the AI industry. 
This company is unique because its very first product will be a safe, super intelligent AI, and it won't focus on anything else until that goal is achieved, Sutskever said. This means it will be protected from outside pressures, like the need to handle a big and complicated product or the stress of competing with other companies. In an interview with Bloomberg published on Wednesday, Sutskever and his co-founders didn't mention who is financially supporting their startup. However, Gross, one of the co-founders, confidently stated that raising money won't be a problem for them. Another thing that remains uncertain is whether the work done by this startup, known as SSI, will be shared with the public as open source software. Open source means that the software's code would be available for anyone to view, use, and modify. However, at this point, the founders haven't made it clear if they will follow this approach. SSI's strong commitment to safety could be a game changer, encouraging major players in the AI industry to balance achieving groundbreaking innovations with responsible development. This shift in focus might pave the way for a future where AI advancements are not only impressive in terms of capabilities, but also developed ethically and with clear safety measures in place. The launch of SSI signifies a new era in the development of artificial intelligence. This is a crucial step forward in the responsible development of artificial general intelligence. The race to develop powerful AI systems is evolving. It's no longer just about who can create the most advanced AI, but also about who can do it in a way that is safe and ethical. This approach could help prevent the potential negative consequences of AI, such as misuse, unintended harm, and ethical issues. If you have made it this far, let us know what you think in the comment section below. For more interesting topics, make sure you watch the recommended video that you see on the screen right now. Thanks for watching.